Hi friends, how are you? Welcome back to my YouTube channel called Tours Excursion by Arta. My name is Oscar, your local guy here in this beautiful bay. Today video, we have a news here. What's going on here in Puerto Vallarta? Well, uh, it seems like four buildings or pre-construction, condos on pre-constructions have problems with Profepa. Okay, this institution protects the environment in Mexico. So they have problems. So maybe they have they're gonna demolish this building if they don't follow uh, the rules here or the restrictions here in Puerto Vallarta. Do you want to know what are those buildings? Well, stay in this video, but before, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, activate all notifications, get the latest news here in Puerto Vallarta and now Nayarit. Remember, I have more news, more information on my uh, social networks. There is uh, Instagram, Twitter, uh, Facebook and more okay uh, don't don't forget to follow me over there and if you want to sponsor me please become a sponsor just join uh, click on the on the bottom join next to the subscribe button and you will support me thank you very much for your support well let's continue with the news what's going on here in Puerto Vallarta Profepa the last um, week uh, uh, did some um, like um, uh, uh, a searching about the, the the constructions, the buildings here in Puerto Vallarta, and they they found that four buildings um, uh, they don't follow the restrictions uh, for build uh, for do the condos. So they have a problem right now. There is a partial closure or or total closure of this. Uh, buildings here in Puerto Vallarta and um, it seems that like a board of these buildings because there is a total of four buildings has a uh, partial closure in, in in the past and they, they don't care and they still um, uh, go with the constructions so that's why they check again uh, what's going on with these buildings and they like re or cancel the construction or, they, or there is a partial closure. Um, there, I'm gonna tell you the buildings for your information. If you want to buy, maybe you want to think twice uh, how, how you're going to buy here in Puerto Vallarta. This is like a big news here in Puerto Vallarta, but it's something that is happening every time here in Puerto Vallarta, what is uh, construction. Why? Because the um, uh, council here in Puerto Vallarta gives the permissions but the, the, the developments don't follow the restrictions for the environment. So Profepa in charge of the environment here in Mexico must to check if they pass or not uh, the regulations. And they don't care, they just continue building. And when they say, no, you can't, and they already have like uh, half of the building or they already um, sold the building. This is the risk of the pre-construction especially if you don't have all the information. So these all are the buildings right now with problems. One is Soho, located at the exit to Miss Maloya in Puerto Vallarta. Uh, the other one is um, Divine, I think, is uh, in the Milano Zapata neighborhood. Very, very good location, kind of uh, four or five blocks away from the Zona Romantica area. The another one is, well, um, is a uh, harbor uh, that is on the Los Camarones beach. And these buildings, it, it's, um, it's, it's, it's the, the, they have history here in Puerto Vallarta because when I arrived here in Puerto Vallarta like three years ago, they, be, they began the, the construction of this building and they, I don't know, abandoned the constructions. And now, uh, like one year ago, they uh, like retake uh, the, the, the constructions of this building they already have uh, or they already done one part but they're doing another tower and the problem with this in in, in harbor 171 is uh, they just say they're gonna build in 30 uh, levels and now it's more than 25 levels and it's like uh it's more than they ask it so it, this is like um it is not a law here in, for for the elections here in mexico in puerto Vallarta. so and there is another another um, uh, building in in Conchas Chinas 
I think it's Carmelia the name, and it's uh, it's it's less, almost already done. Just uh, the construction is done. There's only ins they they are they are um, uh, following with the construction inside, and some of these buildings people are still working. Some are not. They still with the um, partial closure or total closure, and if they don't follow. Uh, the restrictions they're gonna demolish it. so be aware of that this is very very important information if you want to buy a property here in Puerto Vallarta okay remember as I, I, if you want to rent this property well for renting this property is not yet finished so you can't rent it but like Soho uh, is it looks like it's almost done but it's it, with a with the closure or, or partial closure so this is a problem because some people just buy the property or um, put some money for, I don't know, save that kind of properties or one of those properties, don't, uh, those units, and now they have problems because if they don't follow the restrictions, this building is going to demolish and maybe people who put some money, they're going to lose this money or I don't know, but um, I don't know. Here in Puerto Vallarta, I never seen that some building demolish. At the end, they keep going with the construction and, and the buildings are here. So as you can see, there is more and more building here. But um, no, Harbor 171 is the most biggest uh, building and maybe it's gonna be uh, a problem, uh, a bigger problem with that and it's in danger to demolish because they don't follow the restrictions. This is our day news here in Puerto Vallarta. Remember, uh, follow me on my social networks, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel for more information about what's going on here in Puerto Vallarta. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.